It's hard to believe that Christmas is just weeks away. But don't panic, I've made it absolutely simple for you in this month's SA Life magazine. We've got a step-by-step -step guide for your Christmas entertaining. Now, one of the recipes you'll find is for an ice chocolate Christmas pudding, which could easily become your family's new favourite. And best of all, you can make it days ahead. Like all good Christmas puddings, this one's got lots of fruit and nuts. I've got roasted almonds, currants, glacé peel, cherries and glacé pears. Chop those up and soak them overnight in some good South Australian brandy and some cold tea. Next, whip 600 ml of cream and use half of it to line a small pudding bowl and pop that in the freezer. Then we cream 90 grams of butter with 30 grams of cocoa powder. Add three eggs and keep whipping. Take 375 grams of melted chocolate and add that. You can melt the chocolate any way you like, over a double boiler or even in a microwave. Add the fruit and brandy and all the almonds. Another big stir. You can see that it's all mixing in beautifully. Then we need to amalgamate the remainder of our cream. And using a spatula, fold that in. And finally, we whip up three egg whites until they're light and fluffy. Fold it in using a spatula, trying not to lose any of that lovely volume. Do it in a couple of batches. Take our bowl out of the freezer and then fill it up. You can see how the cream has frozen into a gorgeous shell. And that goes back into the freezer to set overnight. When it's time to serve, you obviously need to unmold this. And the easiest way to do that is to plunge it into a bowl of warm water. Not for very long, 30 seconds should do it. Invert it onto a plate and you can take it to the table whole or slice it individually and serve it with some berries and custard. So don't forget to look for the recipe in this month's SA Life magazine.